Hello and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Anna Marie and I blog predominantly over at mummyheartsyou.com. It's a parenting lifestyle blog. So if you've not checked it out, then there is a link below. So do pop over. Um, so this one's a bit of a strange video because um, I've had a few little um, prompts on that I should do it. Um, and I've been a bit nervous about it. And this is like the fourth, fifth, maybe sixth take. Um, so hopefully this is the final take and I, I am able to get it done. Um, but if you follow my blog, if you follow me on Instagram, Twitter, then you will know that I have a huge flamingo obsession. I'm not just talking about like, I mean, I want to adopt a flamingo. It's that bad. I want a flamingo, a real flamingo in my back garden. Um, yeah, it's insane. I have um, quite a few flamingo bits that um, are around my house and I thought I would share with you some of the bits I have. It's not going to be everything because I could be here for hours going on about this flamingo obsession and it could be quite boring for some. So I've just picked out some of the favourite bits that I've got um, and yeah. We'll see, we'll see where it gets us. Right, so I will begin with where it all started. So, for my birthday a couple of years ago, I wanted a diary um, and I wanted a file fax. So my husband bought me a file fax. I chose the print, which was a Flamingos. Now, <clears throat> I really wasn't that interested in Flamingos before this arrived. I, It came and I just fell in love with it. I don't know why, it's quite basic. It's like a tweed effect. And it's got like pink birds all over it. And I really didn't take much notice of them before, but since this, since I got the diary, it everywhere seemed to be, uh, seemed to have flamingos. So yeah, I think I got this at the right time. And yeah, it's just really nice. And it's just basically a, a basic diary. Um, and yeah, so that's one of my, that is my favorite thing that I have. Um, yeah, so that's where it all stemmed from. Um, and then after that, um, I would go on about it for quite some time. And my mum and her husband bought me um, a flamingo statue, which lives in my garden um, between my red robin and my rose bush and she is lovely she's called flora the flamingo she sits nicely and yeah she's just beautiful i absolutely love her she's quite quirky um but yeah she fits in well to our family so i'm going to insert a picture of what she looks like they do sell quite um like quite a lot of variations online um, and they do sell pretty quickly. If I can find a link, I will pop one below, um, but they do, I have noticed that they do a new version and she is a, the Flamingo is a ice bucket for wine. And yeah, she is just as beautiful. Um, I don't drink wine, so I thought she would be perfect to chill my vodka in in the summer. So yeah, I'm gonna, she's definitely on the my want list. Um, so next up, it's just bits around the house. Um, and in my last favorites video, you will have noticed that I have um, some cushions on my bed, um, which is this one. And again, my mum and her husband bought this for me for Christmas. And yeah, they were unsure whether I'd like it. I'm not too sure why, but I do really like it. I like really like the watercolor effect. And that sits on my bed that back with this one so I bought this one quite a lot of this stuff is gifted birthdays Christmas um, and some of it I bought so I bought this one and yeah it was three pounds from Primark I'd seen it quite a few times I got the nudge from my sister that I really should buy it and then yeah I went back and I bought it um, and three pounds is a bargain so but they don't sell this anymore. So yeah, I'm pleased that I did get that. Um, so next up, 
Um, in my bedroom also is this little jewellery dish which sits on my bedside cabinet. Um, and it's just a little china dish and I put my earrings rings um, on it overnight and she this sits on my bedside cabinet with a picture of a flamingo and um, a little flamingo statue which yes, it's just a bit insane really so that's that and then obviously earrings um, that I take out are also flamingos so I have two sets one silver and one gold um, these are the silver ones which I really like um, they're a really nice size for my ear um, and then the gold ones um, are these ones which to be honest I'm not too keen on um, I just think they're a bit too big for my ears they hang down just a little bit um, past my earlobe so um, but I can't throw them away because they're flamingo um, and they were both sets were from a shop called La Visa um, and it was a shop that opened up in my local um, shopping centre and they had an offer on for five pairs of earrings for five pounds so which was a bargain and I bought some other designs not flamingo because yeah they didn't have any flamingo otherwise I would have bought so yeah those two flamingo earrings um also no that's everything for my bedroom so in the kitchen I have a fridge magnet which yeah I went to the zoo saw it and had to buy it yeah um and it was from Whipsonade Zoo and it was really cheap actually so yeah that is on my fridge uh, also in the kitchen I have my cup I was gifted this um, for my birthday from a school mum friend and yeah it has my favourite quote on be a flamingo in a flock of pigeons because sometimes you just need to be a flamingo um, and the print inside is just lovely yeah I love this cup I drink out of it every single day it's the only cup that I would really use um, next I have some bits for the lounge now I will show you these bits down here so I have an extension and I'm own I'm allowed to put flamingo bits in there obviously I don't want to go flamingo board downstairs um, so yeah so first up I have this flamingo print and I was gifted this from a friend and their partner um, and it's from tiger now I don't have a tiger Around here so it was actually really nice that they bought it for me um, they saw it thought of me and picked it up uh, it did come with a black frame but I broke the black frame um, it fell off the fireplace so it smashed um, and then above that picture I have this which is beautiful um, I got this for my birthday from my sister-in-law and it's like a watercolour flamingo print painted and then you've got like the gold detail um, and it's on canvas which is really nice now I'm going to insert a picture of what it looks like downstairs because I can imagine you thinking oh my word she's got so much flamingo stuff I mean it probably looks really bad so I'm going to put a picture in hopefully um, just to let you know what that side of the room looks like because also I've got a shelf that runs alongside those pictures and my little friend sits on the shelf. I was bought this from a school mum friend. She came round for brunch and she bought this for me, which was really kind. Um, and I just love the fact that everybody gets on board with my flamingo obsession because it's just great. Um, so yeah, so they sit all on one side of the wall. Then on the other side um, of the room, I have a side unit. Um, and on it, um, I do have a few little flamingo bits. I have a flamingo LED light, it's like a cut out flamingo, um, which we got from Dunelm and it was 9 99 um, And then my sister-in-law bought me some flamingo string lights, which I absolutely love. And I'm even more excited because now the nights are getting darker, I can put them on and you can actually see them alight. And on the side unit, I have this lovely snow globe which my little boy bought me for my birthday um, and I just love the fact that 
he really gets so enthusiastic about it. Every time he sees a flamingo, he's like, Mummy, there's a flamingo. And I'm like, I've already spotted it. Um, so my little boy bought me this for my birthday and my little girl bought me some earplugs. Uh, no, sorry, not earplugs. Um, some headphones, um, which I use for my laptop because they don't fit into my phone. Um, now they don't have the auxiliary. So yeah, and they're bright pink and they've got like a little flamingo on the ear, which is just great. Um, yeah, so she bought me those. My little boy bought me this, which is very, very cute. I like that. So that all sits on my sideboard, which you will be able to see in the picture. So next up is my phone case, which is flamingo. Um, yep, yeah, I was also bought this from my husband for my birthday. And yeah, I love the colour and it's got tiny little flamingos all over it. So yeah, that's nice. And in my handbag is this pen. It's a flamingo pen, it comes out like so. So whenever someone goes, oh, has anybody got a pen? I'm like, oh, I have a pen, my flamingo pen. But I always sort of have to snatch it back because I'm worried that they're gonna nick it. Um, yeah, so that is my pen and that is from Paper Chase um, and it was really cheap. I mean, so cheap. I'm, I th I'm thinking like £1.50 possibly. Yeah, so I just had to pick that up. Um, next up is some clothes. Now, I'm not going to show you all my clothes because I do quite... I just, it sounds really bad, doesn't it, that I have flamingo clothes. Um, so I have a few bits um, that I do wear quite a lot. Um, this top, for instance, um, this is from Asda and it's got like a little embroidered flamingo on with yeah. Um, I really like this top. I'm not keen on the bottom so I do have to tuck it in because the bottom, I, 